how to plan your route using Valley Transit's route guide. Do you need to be at your destination at a certain time? Follow these steps to plan your trip. First, ask yourself a few questions. Where am I starting from? Where's my final destination? When do I need to arrive? Once you know the answer to these questions, you're ready to plan your trip in reverse. Say your starting point is Bridge Street in Walla Walla, and you need to be at Walla Walla Community College for your 9 a.m. class. What bus stop is closest to your house? The map shows that the bus stop on the corner of Pleasant Street and Bridge Street is closest to you, so start there. This bus stop is on Route 7. It can take a few minutes to walk to this bus stop or longer if you're using a mobility device such as a cane, walker, or scooter. Remember to account for this time when planning your trip. Unfortunately, the Route 7 bus doesn't go directly to Walla Walla Community College, which means you'll need to make a stop at the Transit Center first, where you'll switch to the Route 1 eastbound to Community College bus. This is a direct route to Walla Walla Community College. Looking at the bus schedule, you'll see the Route 1 eastbound bus leaves the Transit Center at 8.15 a.m. and you need to be at Walla Walla Community College for your 9 a.m. class. To catch this bus, you'll need to be at the Transit Center before 8.15 a.m., referring back to the time schedule for Route 7. You'll see that the last arrival for the Transit Center before 8.15 a.m. is at 8.10 a.m. To arrive at the Transit Center by 8.10 a.m., you must catch the Route 7 bus at the Pleasant and Bridge Street stop at 8.01 a.m. If it takes you six minutes to get to the bus stop, you should leave by 7.55 a.m. And that's how you plan your bus route, by working backwards from your planned arrival time. See you on board.